Hello visitors, welcome back to the Google Apps Training Tutorials by Techflow Solutions. This is Ashwin once again and in this video we are going to see how to create a lesson plan using the agenda view in Google Calendar. So first of all, after you log in into your Google Calendar, you can see the list of calendars available and you can just click here and create a new calendar for the lesson plans. So name it as lesson plans. and give a description Well, now just give a location and just click on this create calendar and if you can see here it has been created and let me just change the color for more visibility so yes it's created now so we should create some events in this particular calendar if I just click on this drop down menu and click on create event on this calendar you can create an event that will be called as post event else post period okay and the time will be 21st december and start from 8 30 pm to 9 30 pm okay leave it and just give a description for that this is the first period for learning physics so just click on this save button and see the event has been created and let's create two more events on the same calendar and give it as second event otherwise second period so I'll just give the date and time for that start from 9.30 pm to 10.30 pm and this description well this is the time for learning mathematics so just go ahead and save here well the two events are being created and if we create one more event here third period let it be from 10.30 to 11 o'clock and let us call it as a break So just click on save and see the three events have been created and now if we just click here again and click on this display only this calendar see you can't see the other calendars and only the single calendar is being displayed on the screen so now if we just click on this agenda well you can see the list of all the events present in that particular calendar which you can see on the screen so if I just expand all well you can see the details of each and every event right now if you just click on this more button you can print all these events so I just click on it well you can have several options here you can set the orientation and size and also the descriptions can be printed and it's better that we just remove these three things like print your response and print attendees and print end times because these things wouldn't be necessary if you are using to display your timetable and let's go on and yes you can even save it as a new page or print it else you can just close it and in this way you can 
print this whole the timetable so in this way you can create a lesson plan for your schools from google calendar and if i just go back to the calendar again well if you just click on this individual calendars you can see all the agendas present so similarly you can navigate between the calendars and agendas so this is it for this video thanks for watching this video and please subscribe to our channel and like our videos and please give your feedback on this videos thank you